Hello everyone, welcome to Mind Matrix Learning. So in this video, we'll be talking about all the details of admission procedure that is being followed at Bits Pilani campuses for higher degree. If you want to pursue higher degree from Bits Pilani campus, we are going to cover this all this uh, information in this video and this important this video is going to be very important for you so watch till the end so let's talk about it so they have released their brochure and uh, we are going to cover all the important information in this video so the first thing that we are going to cover is all these programs are being offered by bits Pilani and uh, if we are going to specifically focus on computer science and related to that only so here you can see for computer science uh, all three campuses that is uh, bits pilani bits pilani goa and bits pilani hyderabad all three campuses are offering computer science program and also there is one more program uh, for me that is a software systems but that is offered only at bits pilani not in goa campus and in hyderabad campus just only in bits pilani so these are the two programs being offered for computer science students and uh, rest all are also there rest all programs are also there uh, you know computer science students can apply for this but mainly computer science students are interested in this only these two programs only so yeah so first of all let's talk about the eligibility criteria so a minimum of 60 percent is required in your qualifying degree examination okay for admission in me or m farm right so that means in your BTEC, you should have 60%, aggregate 60%, only then you are eligible for applying this. And one more thing, if you want to apply for uh, all the ME programs or any ME programs, then you uh, basically you have to uh, give the BITS HD admission test or on the basis of GATE score as well you can uh, you know shortlist you can get shortlisted for the admission but only for ex software systems so software systems only bits hd admission test is the criteria that means you have to appear for this test then only you can uh, get admission in software systems me in software systems but for all rest programs you can either choose admission test that is bits hd hd admission test or on the basis of gate score also you can apply i hope it is clear so as you can as you can see here admission to me in software systems will be through the bits hd test only okay you cannot apply it through gate score for software systems right so there are uh, they have provided you three uh, ways uh, through which you can you know apply so a candidate can, can opt uh, opt for one of the following the first one is uh, consideration of admission only basis of only on the base of basis of gate score so if you have a valid gate 2024 or 2023 or 2022 score then you can apply through that okay so apart from that you can also apply only on the basis of marks obtained in bits hd online test so that is also one way to apply for it the third way is also there where you can appear for uh, bits hd test and you can also apply through gate score so that means you can consider both so you can also give your gate score and if you can get you know admission through gate score well and good if not then you will be you know uh, on the basis of your marks obtained in bits hd online test you will be getting a chance to enroll or you know getting the admission there okay and one more thing they have clearly mentioned that a merit list will be prepared for admissions and in each program a maximum of 50 percent of the seats will be filled through gate score and other 50% remaining 50% will be filled by bits hd test marks so they are giving equal preference to both gate score and bits hd uh, test marks okay so this is also one of the important information and uh, they are they have also talked about financial assistance so candidates admitting uh, through gate score they will be given a fee waiver a tuition fee waiver of amount 13400 per month okay during the semester and uh, the candidates who will be applying through bits hd who will be getting admission through bits hd uh, test they will be getting a stipend of uh, rupees 13400 so you can see both are basically same there you will be getting a waiver fee waiver uh, if you are applying through gate and if you are applying through test you will be getting extra stipend basically so you can say both are same thing right now 
apart from that you have to you will have to uh, contribute uh, in you know uh, teaching assistantship assistantship for 8 to 10 hours of work per week and that is there so basically ta ship is there you have to do you can apply through this uh, this uh, admission uh, for the admission you can apply through this uh, website also that is given to you and uh, here it is also mentioned that those who give preference for ME software systems have to appear in BITS HD test okay because gate score has no relevance gate score is not considered for software systems so if you are giving your preference accordingly you have to appear for BITS HD test for software systems what is the deadline deadline for submission of completed application form is 19th of april 2024 so mark this date and uh, do apply before that application fee if you wish to consider through only gate score then thousand rupees is the application fee if you want to consider through you know bits hd online test then or basically use uh, through both as well gate plus test in that case the application fee is 3400 okay the important dates uh, mentioned here is the uh, application portal is op open uh, from 6th of March that is 2024 you can apply and already it has started and the deadline uh, of submission of complete application along with the fee along with the prescribed fee is 19th of April is 19th of April so you can apply and uh, the announcement of admission offers to the candidates based on the gate score is 27th of April so once your result will be announced on 16th of march then they will be opening their you know uh, portal for um, basically entering your marks again and then you will be getting shortlisted for the admission procedure through your gate score so that is iteration one after that uh, candidates will be you have to select the your test slot if you want to apply through your test so you have to select the test slot reserve the date and test slot you can download the hall tickets uh, so every day uh, date is mentioned here bits hd online test will be conducted between 19th of may till 24th of may so during this duration the test will be conducted okay and uh, yes so second iteration in second iteration the admission uh, announcement of admission offers to the candidates will be on the basis of bits hd test and gate that means on the basis of both so that is on 7th of june so these are the important dates you can just go through it again right only one application form you have to fill even if you are applying for multiple uh, programs this is also mentioned here apart from that the eligibility criteria is mentioned here let's say for computer science so equivalent degree integrated first degree of bits or it's equivalent computer science or information technology if uh, degree if you have you can apply 60 percent minimum you should be uh, you should have in your btech so this is there apart from that uh, yes so if you are applying for me in computer science so cs gate score only will be considered right and uh, for software systems as i told you that you will have to appear for the bits hd online test clear this is there and uh, there are some more information related to the test bits hd that is bits higher degree test so online test there will be test one that has to be attempted by all the students that is compulsory for all the students those who are going to appear for this through this hd test not just through gate so test one duration is 45 minutes total number of questions will be 30 and in this section core mathematics like program uh, this uh, probability right stats linear algebra all these topics will be covered calculus all these topics core mathematics topics will be covered 15 questions will be there from uh, that section english language skills and logical reasoning 15 question 15 questions will be there so there is no quant here only these two sections are there in test one and total 30 questions are there test two uh, is for those students who are applying except uh, basically me in software systems and me in environmental engineering except those students uh, this test two will be con uh, you know conducted duration is 105 minutes total number of questions is 70 so basically uh, if you are applying for me in computer science so gate syllabus will be uh, you know all the core subjects like all the uh, entire subject we can entire syllabus we can say for computer science gate computer science will be there and questions will be asked from there only okay so like OSCN, DBMS, TUC, compiler 
right and uh, apart from that programming and data structure algorithms all these subjects will be there clear so that is a discipline specific test but if you are applying for software systems uh, then you have to give this test separately test for software systems duration is 60 minutes total number of question is 50 minutes so through that you have to apply each correct answer will give you three marks and the negative answer i mean the incorrect answer will give you penalty of one mark that means minus one marking minus one mark is there for negative as a negative marking test centers all details is given to you important dates are again mentioned here and uh, syllabus for test one as you can see core mathematics calculus linear algebra probability stats complex variables differential equations numerical methods this is the section one and section two is having english language and logical reasoning so you can go through it quant is not there only the logical reasoning and english verbal is there right apart from that okay this is for syllabus uh, you know test two that is going to be discipline uh, based on your discipline that is if you are from computer science that syllabus will be there gate syllabus will be there basically so all this is mentioned here and also we will be providing uh, the link of this brochure in the description right so so that you can directly go through it and uh, you can apply for the admission procedure at bits pilani campus okay for your me for computer science again it is mentioned the syllabus discrete mathematics is there theory of computation data structure algorithm right design and analysis of algorithms then uh, digital logic is there operating system computer organization and architecture computer networks database system compiler construction that's it so this is the syllabus so you can see entire gate syllabus is there for computer science okay so we have covered all the important details and uh, yeah i think that's it and uh, if you talk about yeah syllabus for special testing software systems so structured programming in c is there they have also given you the reference books so basically if you have prepared for gate computer science most of the topics you have already covered right advanced programming in c right then object oriented oops concepts will be asked and software engineering is also there database system is there core systems like uh, digital logic operating system computer organization and architecture computer networks web technology is also there so all these uh, questions will be asked from this for software systems so this is the syllabus and uh, i hope this video was really helpful for all of you so you can start applying for it and uh, application is already open application portal is already open and for more such information uh, subscribe to mind matrix learning we will be you know making videos for all the you know admissions in all the campuses of iit isc and uh, other colleges as well so that you don't miss any notification and uh, we'll see you in the next video till then take care and bye bye thank you all bye